It's a gunshot! No, oh no, it's an acorn. No, it's a gunshot! No, it's an acorn. <laughs> I can't tell them apart! Hey, we've all heard of the viral video of a Florida cop mistaking an acorn hitting his car with a gunshot, but today, you're gonna get to watch a lawyer blind react to it. So, let's jump in. I'm hit? What? What? I'm in the car! I'm in the car! I, I'm, I'm good. I feel weird, but I'm good. shot at no one at nothing he literally unloaded his entire magazine at not an assailant at, at who at what he said he was shot he actually thought he was hit oh this is so nuts <laughs> so he like violated like almost every single rule they have this is so crazy he could have killed people this is this is so bad <laughs> I'm good, I'm good. Oh. This dude's high. I don't know. Is he high? Get back. Uh, how can he possibly how can he possibly think he's been shot? I, I just this is this is beyond. This is beyond. On the other hand, just imagine if you were in his position and you actually thought you'd been shot at, like you would be stressed out of your mind. You'd probably be acting a fool, but like th this is wild. Like he thinks he's looking for someone who's shooting at him. Okay. It, it might've hit my vest, I don't know. But... Yeah, it might've, it might've hit your vest. It also might've been picked up by a squirrel and has been run off with and will never find the bullet. I'm not. I mean, are they going are they going to charge the tree with attempted murder? Because the tree I, shot an acorn. I don't know. I it felt like it. Jesse, move over to me. I got you. Move over to me. I mean, everybody. Just Everybody thinks that uh, he's uh, right. Right there. Check his wounds. What? What? Oh. Where? Right there? No! 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 What? What is happening right now? So there's another cop there who's seeing the shooting and knows that there's no one to shoot at. I, I... Jesse, Jesse, are you okay? Stop no. shooting! Get in the house, Jesse! Get back, get back, where is he? Where is he? <laughs> 43, give me traffic. He's Shots up in fired. the tree. Shots fired, I got a deputy down. My word. Okay, okay, okay. No. Get back, get back. I'm not gonna tell you go. Get back. 
a Florida cop resigned after opening fire on an unarmed black man who was handcuffed in his patrol car because he confused the sound of an acorn hitting the vehicle with a muffled gunshot. Yeah, that's real, real crazy. Um, if the guy is cuffed in the car, then he can't possibly shoot the officer. You, you got to use your head, okay? That's number one. Number two, if you are cuffing a guy and putting him in the back of your cruiser, you've already made sure he doesn't have any weapons. Like, you're not using your brain... And you're risking people's lives. This is so crazy. Okaloosa County Sheriff's Office Deputy Jesse Hernandez handed in his badge in December following the November 12th Fort Walton Beach incident, officials said Friday. Sergeant Beth Roberts, who also opened fire, was exonerated in an internal investigation and remained on the job, according to police. The suspect, Marquise Jackson, was luckily uninjured, but the situation was traumatic for him, police acknowledged. Jackson could sue him he's not going to win because he wasn't actually hurt. And the and the officer actually believed he was acting in self-defense. You can watch the video. The guy truly believes that he's under attack. He's as, apparently as dumb as a box of hair. Or look, I don't know. Maybe he's been up for 36 hours. Or maybe he's been on multiple shifts. Maybe he's been shot at recently. He's got PTSD. I, I don't know. But this situation was so so dangerous. The deputies had responded to a complaint from Jackson's girlfriend who alleged that the man had committed grand theft auto, threatened her, and was in possession of multiple firearms and a silencer, according to the police. Some people are asking if the girlfriend could sue because she witnessed it. But no, she doesn't have a cause of action. She, she didn't have to watch this distressing event, and it wasn't aimed at her. Mm, literally and figuratively. This is an incredibly fortunate situation that Hernandez didn't actually hurt someone. This, that, was, that was crazy. Something like this can be an occasion for some fantastically valuable training, not only for this police force, but also for police forces around the country where they try to figure out what broke in this guy, like what wasn't working correctly, and then address that with more officers so that things like this don't happen or don't happen as frequently. This footage has gone viral, and deservedly so, and many people are dropping their takes on it, so now I want to hear yours. Drop your pro se opinion down below, all the way down, and hit the trunk of my car. What are your thoughts on the cop's reaction to the gunshot? Are you happy that he's off the force? Is that enough? Let me know what you think, and don't be startled. But something very loud is about to slam down in three seconds, and it's not a gunshot. <laughs> I seriously thought you were messing with me. I did not. I did not think it was going to be like this. 